What's up guys and welcome back to 2K20. Uh, today uh, we are here in the neighborhood for the first time and uh, it's time to get some customization going. We haven't really done all that much so far. We're rocking the, the stock shoes, the stock fit. This brown shirt gotta go bro. So uh, here we go. We are gonna head into 2K shoes to start things off. Let's see who we're working with. So gotta get some on court shoes, some off court shoes. Let's see what we can do man. All right so we got what's new or the neighborhood. Uh oh man. I honestly didn't even think about about what I wanted coming in here, but uh, we're we're just gonna gonna do a little browsing. You guys do know I get a free pair of Jordans here, so I'm looking. Hmm, what do you guys think? I feel like some ones would be dope. I feel like we've we've rocked those in the past before, though. I really like fours, obviously. Elevens um, are pretty dope. Uh, what should we should we keep it simple and just go with some ones or maybe some fours? Let me see the the color options we have here. So I mean. Playing for the Raptors, something like this would be pretty dope. I'm not going to lie. Let's try these on. The we probably should have yeah, went and got, got the fit first and then bought the shoes to go with the fit. But I guess we could start with the shoes and, and build the fit off of that. But I feel like some, some fours here will look pretty good. I don't know. We Our first pair is free, like I said. So maybe we should be going for something a little more expensive. But I, I feel like those are pretty dope. I like them. We could go for something like this. Those are pretty dope as well. Do we like the red instead of having the black on there? I feel like I kind of like the black, the red and black. Those aren't bad. I'm, I'm going to go with this. All right, we're going to go ahead and add that to the cart. Let's go to our cart and uh, let's go ahead and check out. Do we have on-court shoe options or was this all part? There was no like, I don't think there was an on-court shoe option. There was just what's new and then there was neighborhood. Oh, NBA on-court. You just had to scroll down. I'm an idiot. All right, so uh, what do we want to do here? What do you guys think? But obviously, it's going to automatically apply our team colorways. And we don't necessarily have to do Jordans. I feel like that makes sense. If we have the sponsor, we might as well. Those look awesome. How do you guys feel about the ones for games? I don't know, we're, we're keeping it pretty classic, pretty simple. I, I'm not trying to roll out there with some some clown shoes, you know what I mean? Like, I, I feel like something like that's pretty, that's pretty classic, that's pretty dope. I like that. Could also go for something like, ooh, those are kind of nice. Or we've got that. Hmm. Very small change on the tongue there. What do you guys think? Do you like the black swoosh or do you like the red and white? I'm going to go with the black. Let's go with this. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and add that to our cart. Looks good to me. So it looks like these are cheap as or, or free as well. Not even cheap. They're just straight up free. So we'll we'll take it. We've got some Jordans for the park. We've got some Jordans for the court. And now it's gonna be time to head over to Swags. Hi, welcome to Swags. My name's Casey. What up, Casey? We got some 2K Day, 2K Day clothing. Gonna be kind of a limited type release, I guess. I don't know if I'm really loving anything here. I'm trying to think what what type of a fit do we wanna go for? I'm gonna start with the bottoms. Do we want, I mean, do we wanna be chill? Do we wanna be in like shorts and stuff? Do we wanna go with some jeans? Do we wanna go with some moto pants? I feel like moto pants are, are probably cool if I try this on. Of course, probably gonna be the way to go if we're trying to be a, a little bit trendier, you know what I mean? I'd like to stay a little bit trendy. I wish they added more stuff. I feel like I feel like a lot of the stuff is the same every year. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay with the black for now. I'm gonna add those to the cart, and then we're gonna go out. We're gonna take a look at uh, at shirts and, and options up here. T-shirts, long sleeve, compression shirts. There are like no options here. We had a, a speckled T. This is literally, I think, the outfit that we've had before. I mean, something like this is gonna look dope with the shoes that we got. Whatever. I'll go ahead and add this for now. I'm not super stoked on it. Let me see what we have for long sleeves. Nothing really too crazy here. Tank tops are all pretty average. All right, yeah, I'm I'm down for this. We'll rock with this for now. Let's go to our cart and check out. At least we have an option there. I'm gonna head over to the, uh, ooh, that's the new tattoo shop. We are definitely gonna be going in there. That looks way different. But uh, at least we have we have options here. I'm gonna go ahead and go to the NBA store and I'm gonna see, I'm gonna see what we can find in here because we might be able to, to spice it up a bit. I'm not trying to be too boring. I feel like we're being pretty basic so far. All right, so we got jerseys, on-court accessories. Bro, I could get some WNBA t-shirts. That's what I'm talking about. Some G League t-shirts. We got the Lakeland Magic up there. I want to go to a Lakeland the magic game should we get some beats black and red beats for eight g's bro why not i'm gonna add those to the cart we got money we can get uh oh shoot we can't wear a watch unlocked at rep level rookie three bro that's dope i want to get a watch okay so we can't do anything with that yet got mitchell and s i'm gonna see what we got for our uh, our raptors here bro some of these old school joints these are these are pretty cool give this one a look. you got it 
We, we could work with it. We should have put our pants on. I mean, we are up in Toronto after all, so of course it's going to be kind of cool. Dude, I miss that old logo. Honestly, their new stuff is cool, but I feel like their old stuff was even better. I don't, I, I'm going to keep this in mind. We might come back to that in the future. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, Express Team Gear. Ooh. Okay. I actually have, I have the suit, the Orlando Magic suit jacket from Express. Some of this is kind of dope. Let me see. Um, bro, they've got... They've got the magic, but they, they don't have the raptors. That That's honestly kind of crazy. I'm really surprised by that. I would have rocked something like this. That's kind of cool. So they probably aren't going to have the raptors on anything, are they? No. Dude, this stuff is is dope. I, I would have rocked something like that, but we can't. All right. So let's see. Uh, let's see some tops. Go down to our raptors. I mean, something like this is pretty cool. We can either go sleeveless or with the sleeves. Think with our moto pants and the shoes. I mean, that's not... I kind of like the... Bro, the sleeveless... I mean, we could kind of show off the guns, show off the tat a little bit. We've got more options here. Full on logo in the front. So this has a Nike logo that has the, the Toronto logo or we've got the black and red. Well, if we're if we're wearing black on bottom, I'm, I'm going to go with this. I'm going to go ahead and add that to the cart. Would it be weird to rock a Lowry jersey? <laughs> Imagine walking into the locker room, dude. Just rocking a, a Lowry jersey or something. Van Fleet jersey. Siakam jersey. Nah, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll pass. All right, I, I think we're okay. Ooh, on-court accessories. Should we get anything or should we just wait? I think I might, I might wait for it. Well, we could get, we could get some tall socks. I'll, I'll get those for now. Compression apparel. I'll get some compression pants and a top. We could customize this whenever we want, so we might as well, might as well get this while we can. I'm gonna get a, uh, a hex pad arm sleeve for our left arm. Yeah, dude. This is, uh, this is gonna be dope. Or actually, no, we would want it on our right arm, our shooting arm, right? We'd be, like, compressing it because it's injured. Looks gonna be. We're gonna blow a bunch of money here. 11k. Whatever. Hold up. I gotta flex on y'all real quick. Look at these beats. Wait. Those aren't even the beats. Hold on a second. Do I need to customize that? You gotta go to your player appearance, change your clothes and everything else. Clo oh, man. <laughs> I didn't even have them. All right. So, neighborhood top, we're gonna go with this. Bottom, we're gonna go with the moto pants. Headphones, we're gonna go with the beats. Looks good. Bro, look at how we're gonna look on court. This is honestly pretty solid. Like, I'm, I'm happy with how this turned out. I think we look pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. I like all the compression and everything, and we're gonna add uh, some tattoos here. So, uh, boom, looks looks good. This is our, our fit for the uh, the neighborhood and everything. We're all matching, matchy, matchy, baby. Including the beats and everything, this is, uh, this is dope. I don't know why I just said matchy, matchy, I don't. I apologize for that. Anyway, we are going to head into the tattoo shop and we're going to see what we have going on here in paint tattoo. So you guys know in previous years, what kind of work you looking to get? I'm trying to work on you, girl. Now, in previous years, we we got tattoos as the story went on, as we played games, as the season went on, and each one had like a meaning to it. Like when a big thing happened, we got a tattoo for it, and we dropped our first 30 point game, 40 point game, et cetera, et cetera, and we kind of made a sleeve as we went along. So I think that's what I want to do here. Let me see some of their sleeve options just because I'm curious. Oh, wow, dude. See, that would look good with the, the red and black. We've got dinosaur sleeves. We've got a dragon. They have anything sea related? Oh, so you guys know I'm I'm a sucker for uh, for like oceans and stuff like that. But I think to start things off, probably our biggest life moment up until this point is getting drafted by the Raptors. So we're gonna go in here. We're gonna pick a Raptor logo and let's go ahead and place it. So we're gonna place this. I'm gonna say uh, let's get tatted on our left arm. Not gonna affect our shooting or anything like that. And uh, what do you guys think? Should we just? I mean. I feel like you could kind of put it up on the shoulder, but is that kind of lame? I feel like we need to save save something better for that. So I'm going to put it, um, I think I'm going to put it like right, right here. Nothing too big, nothing too small. It's just going to be on the inside there. Just kind of remind us who took a chance on us. Go ahead and place it and get inked, baby. How much is this going to cost us? A thousand VC? Yeah, man. I don't even want to know how much we're going to end up spending on VC as the time goes on. But uh, there we go. Our first tat. I'm feeling good. We're looking good. Let's go get in a game. JK, the last thing we need to do doesn't involve spending any VC, thankfully. So we are going to go over to our progression. I think we have a couple new badges we need to select. Yeah, we've got uh, a finishing badge and a shooting badge. So you guys will have to let me know what you think. I feel like you can't go wrong with Acrobat. Boost the ability to make layups and have a high degree of difficulty. So as we're driving to the basket, we're, you know, off our step. We're doing little spins and stuff like that. I think that's going to be important. 
Consistent finisher obviously is good. Contact finisher would be really good as well. Um, actually, you know, I'm gonna go contact finish. Contact finisher looks good to me. So let's go ahead and confirm that. And then for shooting, I mean, catch and shoot is obviously good. I I know people have been talking about how good quick draw is. Speed up the release of a jump shot. Obviously, when you're you know in traffic trying to get something off quickly, that'd be good. But I think I'm gonna start with. Uh, what is the impact of a defender who is closing out? So we've got Deadeye. Flexible release would obviously be really good because sometimes your boy doesn't have like the perfect release. Shoot. I mean, I, we really can't go wrong here. We're eventually going to upgrade all of these. So I'm, I'm going to go with flexible release to start things off. But it uh, looks good to me. All right, it's time to get back on the grind. Let's get to our, uh, get to our next game, which we're going to be playing against the Magic. So we're going to go in advance and I'll see you guys there. About to wipe the floor with these fools, just like in the, the 2019 NBA Finals. I'm going to just go cry myself to sleep, man. The Magic hadn't been to the playoffs in so long. I was so excited this last year. Went to both home playoff games that we had before we were knocked out in the first round by the Raptors. I'm I'm still upset about it. I don't know why. This this water, I'm going to keep it real with you guys. This water cup is, is Bella's. She always hops up on the desk and drinks out of it. It's weird. I... I don't get it. So it's a good thing I didn't drink it. Anyway, here we go. Let's get it. Look at Aaron Gordon out there. Chelsea always tells me she's got a, uh, a couple of couple of free haul passes. Aaron Gordon would be one of them. Steph Curry would probably be the other one. So she also likes uh, likes Fournier and the Magic as well. I uh, should probably stop taking her to basketball games. Here we go, fellas. Let's see what we can do. See if we're gonna get in. I guess technically it's not even guaranteed we're gonna be getting getting playing time, but uh, hopefully. Ooh, coming in. We got Fournier. Okay, this is what I'm talking about. About to make you look stupid, bro. This is what you get for trying to trying to steal my girl. Handsome Frenchman. Let's go. Give me that board. Let's go. Kick it up. I think he's got a that, ooh, right now feels like well, that's okay. I was gonna say that's an assist, but it's not. Not if he's getting hit like that. We look legit. We look legit with the sleeve and everything. Oh, the compression sleeve, the shorts, the scrunched up socks. I consider myself a pretty big Magic fan. It's weird playing against them. I don't really like playing against them. Oof. Fournier just took it to us, bro. All right, let's see what we can do. Get back door on him. I don't think we're going to be able to. Buckets, guarded by Fultz. Here's Buckets. Oh my goodness. Okay, thought we might be able to draw some contact there, but no, we just we just got got smacked. All right, we're down by 10, boys. We got to step this up. Got a couple of free throws here. Let's see if we can Oh. Trev, what is happening? I like that that Toronto tat though. I feel like we put that in a pretty good spot. It just sucks because like for a while you're uh you aren't really tat. You know what I mean? Like the the way we do it, where we kind of add one. No sir, we add one every little bit. You aren't really tatted for a while. Let's go. Got the ball. Draw another foul. Let's make both of these, please. What the? Bro, we gotta work on our free throws. Are you kidding me right now? There it is. Or your boy just gotta get a better, better release. Usually we're green lining it. I don't know what's up today. There we go. Oh my goodness. Put it up, bro. What are you doing? He's <laughs> like dribbling under the basket, wide open. These guys are really, really taking advantage of all the uh, the shot clocks, man. They went down to like the, the last couple seconds of every shot clock, not just at the end of the quarter there. But all right, not not a bad quarter for us. Could have had a couple more points with those free throws, but I like to do all those things. Up, blocking shot, uh, straight the floor, making open shot, you know, rolling the basket, screen, you know, those dirty work. I like to do that. He likes to do the dirty work, huh? I respect that. All right, so we're gonna sit our butt on the bench. Magic is starting to pull away a little bit. Come on, boys. I'm gonna come in and I'm, I'm gonna start taking over at the, oh, here we go. Starting to mount a little bit of a comeback. We're gonna come in down by eight. Here we go. No good on the shot. And it's the Raptors taking it the other way. Here we go. Give the ball. Bro. Yeah, some history here though. Can't leave me open. Let's go. I was gonna ask for the ball and then immediately dish it down low. We were gonna have a nice little assist train there. Nice little ball movement train, but he just didn't get us the ball. Here we go. Jonathan Isaac, what you got, bro? I got hoes calling. Can you imagine how cool it would feel to be him when you hear that song, dude? <laughs> 
That would be insane. Fournier can't hold on to the ball. There we go. Come on, baby. Oh, my gosh. 51 seconds left now here in the second. Aaron Gordon. All right, bro. I see you. Shoot. I really wish we wouldn't have forced that three, dude. If we if we would have taken our time there, I feel like we could have we could have made a, a big difference. Oh. Wow. Okay. Things are starting to fall apart a little bit right here. Good move, Trav. Good move. Way to get in there. Way to get dirty. All right, seven-point game. Come on. 29 seconds. Let's get a stop here. Score. Bring it to, to five or less. Come on, baby. Get a stop. Get a stop. Get a stop. No, 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 no. Don't let him down there. No, 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 no. No. Well, at least it's going to be under 10. Let's go, baby. I was just running around in the paint by myself, not really doing much. All right, so it's going to be a uh, it's going to be a fairly close game here. Seven points. We can do this. We'll see how the second half goes. Gotta pick up the intensity on D for sure. Your step slow tonight. Got you, coach. We got time. Keep grinding. I'm going to be honest, I feel like we weren't playing bad D. I think we, I think our dude scored on us once. We've been helping out quite a bit. I, I feel like that was kind of uncalled for, but I guess I'll take it. I'll always take some criticism from the coach. Not going to argue. That's one thing I wish this game did do a little bit better is I feel like help defense. It doesn't know the difference between leaving your man and helping out your teammates on D. Like if you leave your dude to go help your, your teammate, you don't get credit for it at all. Well, we're now down by 20, so this is good. DJ Augustine subbed in for Markel Fultz. Oh my goodness, we gotta hit those, Trev. Come on. That was a short, short little bank jumper. We can't miss him. Shooting 50% from the floor. This is not our best game ever. <laughs> Get that shit out of here, you little runt. I actually really like DJ. I wasn't gonna let him have that layup for free, though. But see, that's what I mean. Like, we're coming over, we're making plays, saving our teammates' butts. Let me get a pick and roll. When they lapse on defense and they need our help, we're there for them. Let's go. Good drive. That's our little badge at work right there. A little bit of contact, we'll take it. But yeah, we, we, we come out here and we make plays on defense and then we get yelled at by coach because we're supposedly leaving our... Oh, shh. We just got burned, though. Let's go. Give me the ball. Give me the ball. I see you. We keep coming in with less than a minute, so like I, I don't really have like we're coming in and making a difference, but I don't really have the time to time to truly do much. Got you, bro. Woo! Good layup. See, we're starting to come back. We were down by 20. We're now down by 13. But there's 18 seconds left in the quarter. We're gonna come back in the fourth. It's just I, I don't know, dude. I'm gonna call timeout. We got 2.2 seconds left. Let's go. Come on. Please don't take me out, coach. I'm gonna nail this three. I promise you. I promise you. Let's make a difference here, boys. Let's bring it to 10. She is feeling herself. Come on. He took me out. Are you serious? I'm like one of the best shooters on the team, and you're gonna take me out like that. Come in, start bringing the game back, and you bench me. We're down by six with seven seconds. Gotta oh, that's a green light three. Hold on a second. We're down by three. Got to foul quick, foul quick. And hope that he doesn't make either one of these. Uh-oh. Vooch. What you got, bro? Of course he's clutching up. My man. I ain't mad at it. All right, well, our first loss is going to come at the hands of the Magic. Should have requested them. I purposefully didn't in this series, though, because we always play for them in, like, you know, 2K, 19, 18, 17, whatever, whatever, so. Wanted to mix it up. I'm happy to see the Magic got some redemption after losing in the playoffs last year. We'll take it. That was great. See, I love having a pro on to give us the inside scoop on it. Scoop it and ship it, Hank. What you said. It's going to suck walking into a locker room after a loss. Just thinking about what you could have done better. In this case, frustrated the coach, didn't you? Didn't play you more, didn't believe in you more. You're exhausted, you gave everything, and you just lost. It's the, the beginning of the season, though. It's not that big of a deal. All right, fellas, game two of the episode. I'm thinking I'm thinking we do two games per episode. I feel like with the way we're cutting these down and kind of cutting to the highlights and stuff, that makes it so it's a video that has some meat to it, but it's it's not too long, not too short, that sort of thing. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. But um, so we've got the Pistons in town today, and it looks like they're off to a pretty hot start. Yikes. I don't know. It's not, not too bad. We're coming in. Coming in down by three. We got this, fellas. 
And it's a completely new group for Toronto. No, he's sir. <laughs> you thought you were going to do something. Nah, fam. He backed us all the way up. I was like, what are you going to do? Get like a backcourt violation or what? But he uh, he had no intent of, of doing anything, I don't think. Look at that. Nice box out. We're playing hard today, fellas. Woo. Oh, okay. I should have... I was going to take that myself, and I guess I should have. I guess I should have, dude. Here we go. All right. This is a Oh, my. What is happening right? This is the sloppiest basketball I think I've ever seen. Come on, boys. We can do so much better than this, and it's not even, it, like, 100% not my fault, dude. Catch and shoot. Green. Splash, baby. Let's go. Little pick and roll. Yes, sir. To Ibaka. Ibaka, you got to finish these, man. I see you. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. See, your boy instantly comes in and starts facilitating the offense out here, even as a shooting guard. That's got to say something, coach. Put me in, coach. Woo. Let's go. Look at that. Your boy is just running the offense from the wing, huh? Making everything happen out here today. Kyle Lowry, dude. He's the man. Let's see what he's, he's got going on. Changed the game of basketball in Canada. He created something that is forever lasting. And I think the game of basketball in, in Canada owes him a lot because he really brought the buzz to the game of basketball in Canada. Oh, he's got a good point there. Oh, look at this. We're actually staying in. Okay, I'll take it. Let's go. Yeah, this is the first time we've ever stayed in after the first quarter, which is kind of nice. We're three for three in the day so far. Assist, block, six points. Playing some good D on, on D Rose here. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. I feel like we're really working working through our Oh baby, the and one. We're working through our stamina a bit. I feel like we've been doing nothing but a bunch of sprinting. But we'll take it, dude. This is pretty much the opposite of how that first uh game went today. Nope. Give me that board. Let's go. I'm gonna kick it up. Yes, sir. We'll take it. Another assist. Dude, we are playing really, really good right now. As a squad and, and personally. Here we go. Down. Or we're up by four. Never mind. Not down anymore. We'll take it. It's a good foul long as he doesn't make it. I doubt we get to play too much more here. We're starting to get a little bit later into the second. I see you, Kyle. I got a pick set for you. Ooh, oh, the green light. <laughs> Don't do it to him, brother. Oh my goodness, got the assist. Five seconds on the shot clock, find somebody to box out. And get that board. Let's go. Kick it up to Kyle Lowry. Oh, dude. Okay, that hurts. Not today. <laughs> Let's go. Siakam, I see you, bro. I, I see Siakam, you. Come on. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Bro, we're hot, baby. All right, we're going to use our takeover before the half is over because we're going to sit on the bench and then we're going to lose it. I'm going to use it use it next possession. I'm going to run baseline and get ready to, to take a jumper. Oh, shoot, we don't have it anymore. Come on. Oh, my. See, I was ready to do that with our takeover, but I don't know why our takeover isn't an option anymore. And we just got got, got there. Come on, baby. Oh, give me the ball back. I did not mean to pass it to you. Thanks, bro. Good stuff. Holy cow. We'll take it. 14 points with eight in the paint. Who am I, bro? A majority of our points are in the paint. Usually, we're just jacking up threes. That was nice. Well, the Pistons, they're an exciting team to watch. I never really pay too much attention to them, but they've, they've got a great lineup. So, as expected, we get did get taken out there towards the end of the second, but that was after your boy came in. Put in some work, got us a lead, and it looks like they ate up almost all of it before the end of the half, but we're going to have a chance to add a couple of points here. Let's see what uh, see what our boys can do. Nail that three. Nail that three. It's hard to watch it from the bench because you can't. The camera is very wonky. Killing it tonight, Shay. Let's go. Love the intensity. You get an open look, keep taking it, all right? That's what I want to see. Stay aggressive. Be aggressive. E aggressive. We're getting buckets out there, baby. Bro, it's the third quarter and Derrick Rose just scored his first points. I don't think that that bodes very well for us. Here's buckets. Come on, baby. Oh, you gotta be able to finish those, Trev. We're okay though. 
Let's go ahead and make sure we knock both of these down. We're here at home, so we have that home court advantage. Not as nervous, should be able to get those those green lights, that's what I'm talking about. 16 points already. Looks like uh, we came in down by five, we're now down by three after that. Ooh, beautiful. Give me the ball. Whoo! I thought he was gonna knock down the three. He should have, we, sh we could have hit Siakam as well. I see you, pal. Let's go! That's what I'm talking about, pal! Pistons hadn't won a playoff game in more than a decade. Still not the result they want. Derrick Rose with a nice drive there. All right, can't can't be mad about that, dude. The Pistons are on a 12 to 4 run right now. You see what happens when your boy gets taken out of the lineup. I need this pick and roll. That's not the shot I wanted. That's not the play I wanted. That is not. That is just not what I wanted right there. But we ran out of time, unfortunately. From 15, Let's go. Good box out. Good board. Kick it up. I feel kind of slow today. I, I don't know. Like, I was feeling good in the first half, and now I'm feeling kind of slow in this half. I'm feeling like we're really struggling to, to cut and get open. Left our assignment because I was helping out on D over there, of course. And boy, what a year it was. Woo! Let's go. Oh, my goodness. We're going to be able to knock those down, man. Come on now. And, oh. I thought we lost it. I think sometimes what we need to do is you guys will see on the free throw line, our stamina will actually build up as we're standing there. So we could take a couple of seconds to just kind of rebuild our, our stamina a little bit, take a little bit of extra time. I feel like that wouldn't be a bad move. I see you, Siakam. Get big, bro. Let's go. I think part of the problem is, is we're just we're we're losing a lot of stamina playing defense. I mean, these guys are, are heavily running this offense through Derek. Oof, right in our face. I was late to, to contest there. But they're heavily running the offense through Derrick Rose, so we're we're just, I mean, we're we're using a lot of our energy, a lot of our stamina. Try to play some D and lock him down. Also try to keep our team in it. We're up by one. Unreal, dude. I don't know where our teammates are at on, on stuff like that. 22 seconds. Give me this ball. Here's Buckets. Let's go! Did I get rid of it though? I don't know if I got rid of it. Hold on a second. That was really close. I, I think I waited. I think I waited a second too long. Hmm. Not even close. Bro, not even close. Your boy is clutch AF right now. We're going off. This is this is one of our better games for sure. And the call is going to be overturned. The second look shows that he did in fact beat the clock. Let's go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That's going to give us a two-point lead going into the final quarter of the game. Your boy has ice in his veins. Our boys lost the game in the fourth quarter. That is so frustrating, man. Don't play the dude that had, had all the points in the game. You know what I mean? Why, why would you play the guy that, that put the team on his back and was having a great night? I don't care if you're second or third string, bro. Like, if you're having a hot night like we were there, playing ball on both ends of the court, you've got to keep us in, man. That is absolutely ridiculous. What were our final stats? 23 points, 4 assists, or 4 rebounds, and 5 assists. And they didn't keep us in the game. Hey, Che, you got a second? Yeah, what's up? This is your first time leading the team in scoring. <laughs> I think that helped you become more of a leader overall. Yeah. I think you have to earn that over time. You have to prove you're consistent. Anybody can be a scorer, right? But it takes a lot more to be a leader. And honestly, I don't think I'm there yet. Great. Thanks, Jay. Thank you, guys. We've had pretty fiery answers in all of our stuff so far, so I feel like that was a good answer. To be honest, I'm kind of... I'm kind of partial to the fiery ones, though, because then you get fans and social media activity and stuff.